Remember over the winter when Ride Entertainment posted an article saying that they were going to be building a record-breaking Gerstlauer in the United States in a challenging location? And everyone thought it would be going to Cedar Point. Well, it's actually not going to Cedar Point. It is actually going to Glenwood Caverns in Colorado. Introducing Defiance, the newest Gerstlauer Infinity Coaster to open up in the United States, located at Glenwood Caverns Adventure Park in Colorado. In today's video, I am going to be discussing this new addition, what I liked, what I think they could have done better, and and all that. So, let's get into Defiance at Glenwood Caverns. Alright, let's go ahead and start with the stats for this ride. It'll have a 110 foot drop at a 102.3 degree angle, so beyond vertical. It'll be 1,300 feet above the town and Colorado River, which is because it's on top on the mountain. And, it, and the lift will be 75 feet. And the, um, it, its elevation height will be 7,132 feet above sea level. And, 50, and it'll go 56 miles per hour and have three inversion. As you can see, it'll be straddling the Iron Mountain. And so if you remember back in the article, that was leaked over the winter about the ride being built in a challenging location. This is what they meant. This ride is going to be built on a mountainside. That this is going to be a very visually impressive roller coaster. Like, man, that's one thing I'm excited about this ride. I am excited to see this ride get built. Because this is going to be a very challenging project. They even say it in the article leaked by USA Today that was put out. They're the ones who announced it. Saying that it's going to be a challenge to even get the materials and stuff to the construction site. Because of how challenging it is to get there. Like this is going to be a ride that you're going to want to sit back and watch get built. I'm hoping they have a live camera uh, for this construction site because I want to see this ride get built. That's what I'm very excited about. So here are my thoughts. I am excited for this. However, I can't help but be a little underwhelmed with the layout because if you remember, how, um, like when we heard one of a kind record-breaking Gerslauer, we thought like it would be like bigger than any other Gerstlauer, have the most inversions in the world, all that stuff. However, we get a layout with just three inversions, and that's basically just the layout. So I can't help but feel a little disappointed. However, I can understand why they went with what they did because of how challenging the terrain is there. Like it would have it would have been much more expensive and required a lot more materials and more time to make a bigger layout. So I heavily understand and I def and I really understand why they went with what they did, but it is a little disappointing. However, it is what it is. And I'm sure this ride will still be a really good ride and will be the best uh, roller coaster at Glenwood Caverns. And I hope that this is the start of, of bigger and better things for that park. And I think we'll see some nice more new roller coasters added to that park over the next 5, 10, 15, 20 years. So in conclusion, am I excited for this ride? Absolutely. I think this will be a wonderful addition for Glenwood Caverns. And we'll be and we'll put help put this park on the map. And and I think we'll attract a lot more guests over to that area in Colorado for this for this park. And like this park is already unique. Like they have probably the most unique drop tower. All that. So thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.